Apollo, Apollonius, like, it's too, it's too easy to not, for Apollo to not be the reincarnation, right? And then a tutor is like, Baka idiot, there's no way it's as simple as that. And Silver is like, yeah, what are you fucking talking about? There's no way that Apollo would be the wings of the sun, Apollonius. Because one, I hate him and don't want to fuck him. And two, he's shit. And then they talk about how they... Yeah, and she's like, fuck you, bitch. But anyway, they talk about their own psychic powers and their, how they have to do training. And Drake is like, wait, maybe Apollo is Apollonius. <laughs> yeah, Kate takes out his no pen. It's a combination robot where I get naked with babes. Hmm, yes. Um, but they talk about it, and uh, and it's not just piloting training. Fudo also gives them weird training. Yeah, and they're explaining about Baron. Baron, here's my friend. He got yoinked and kidnapped by the angels, and I'm gonna kill him. Fuck him. That's Pierre. He's Brazilian, and likes football. That's Yun. Uh, Jin. He's the nerd. Sagumi's also a nerd. Sagumi's also a nerd, and. Doesn't want to have sex. Yeah, talking about Fudo again. He's a uh, Fudo again. It's weird. He's weird. Uh, yeah. Uh, Ryo is like Fudo again, and Ryo says, "Oh yeah, that uh, that man with the loud voice is Diva's commander, Fudo again, and he's the uh, the one that, that had the elements come here to train under the Geta team because they have a similar combination system of three planes crashing into each other." Um, Pierre is grateful because they got all the combination down uh, thanks to Ryo's help, but the mutual training also helped Benkei uh, get up to speed. And Apollo's like, yeah, well, it's fine with that, but what annoys me is when Pops decides to bust out his special stuff, like running around barefoot, trying to read each other's minds, playing hide and seek. And she was like, that sounds like fun! He's like, it ain't. You don't explain nothing, and all his nonsense is just a pain. It's a pain. And then Fudo pops out and is like, this only proves how unfledged you still are. And I was like, Bleh! And uh, it's like he came out of there and has he's known for his godlike speed. Ryoma, thanks to you and everyone's assistance, these chicks were able to fly a little. But if it's chicks as in baby chickens, wouldn't that make them flightless birds? T -t -t Sorry. Whoa, Shin totally backed down. <laughs> Genkuril, what incredible pressure. Did not talk back to Genfudo. But either way, the elements training is uh, mostly over, and Fudo wonders if they can withstand the rigors of actual combat. Sirius uh, believes they can, thanks to the training they had here, and uh, that, and because their bodies, minds, and skills are sharper than ever. And Pierre thinks uh, they can take on any enemy, be it fallen angels, demons, or whatever. And Fudo is like, "Good, because you're going with Zeus." Jerome is like, "Well, well, but we're meant to be part of Diva. We like." We shouldn't work with Zaft in the AUG. And Fudo says, "You're not working with the Zaft in AUG. You're working with Zuth." And it's my. D and uh, Sophia says, "And if it's his decision, we gotta." And now, Kate, and who would this lovely doctor be? My name's Sophia Bellin. I'm a psychotherapist, so I'm a bit different from the usual kind. Well then, would you like to hear what ails me? If it's a worldly desire, then the commander would be a better counselor than I. I'll pass. <laughs> okay, you devil. You got them dirty dog. But anyway, now they've got to talk about the pilots for Aquarian. There's seven, but only three can sit in the seats at a time, and each combination has different attacks. Um, but Fudo says that Apollo will always um, pilot um, the Vector Sol. So the other six have to switch between Vector Mars and Vector Luna. Uh, pattern A is Sirius and Sylvia. Pattern B is Pierre and Sylvia. Pattern C is Sirius and Reika. Pattern, pattern D is Pierre and Reika. Pattern E is Jun and Sugumi. Um, Jirion's are glad to have Apollo and everybody as teammates, and uh, they're glad to be back too. Uh, Garrett says, we've also got Big O too, so things are looking up. And Cappy's like, hell yeah, we're invincible with all these machines. And uh, he's like, mm, not so sure, little boy. And he says, from now on, the enemies we will be fighting are within the hearts of each each one of us. And Apollo's like, you're not making any sense again! But yeah, Fudo, he's a good dude. He's a, he's a real good dude. And then there would be a RAND secret. But there isn't. Because we in the RAND group. So don't worry about it. Yeah, I'll buy another thruster. I'll never fucking stop buying boosters.